a buddy of mine got kind of duped with a fake watch. I hope your friend is able to recuperate his $83,000. This AP, unfortunately, isn't authentic. Bring the stuff, man. I'm very fair. I'll buy it. I have the money right now. I we'll take all of them. on the way to make some reels for the 100k prize competition so if you haven't signed up make sure you check out our stories and click on the link below get a chance to win all you got to do is buy an entrance worth three dollars okay and you will have a chance to be one of the next next lucky winner we're watching let's see what you got i haven't seen one of these in a while all right so we have a 2024 Sky Dweller chocolate dial. We got a rose gold Daytona. I just bought one of these this morning. Yeah. And we got the platinum day date. Let's start with this one. How much are you asking here? He wanted 37, but I wanted 40. I just bought one this morning and yeah. your glass is a little scratch and you have a nasty dent. Yeah, right there. I have that one. Yeah, dent and, and the glass one. here. Yeah. Okay. Where are we at on this more or less? I want 45. He won 43. So you want 45 here, mm -hmm. you want 40 here, mm -hmm. and what about on the chocolate sky dollar? What do you want? That, I'll pay for 45. It's a day date 41. This was the one that was out before the day date 40 came out. You see the smooth bezel, but one of my favorites is what you call the blackout dial or the or the, the murder dial. It's matte black with gloss black Arabic numerals. Oh my God, don't tell me you're selling all that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's not far from the asking. His askings are realistic asking. What, what are you asking in this? I want it 40. Yeah, that's not possible. You can meet me somewhere. They want 37 on that one. 37 is a good offer on that. Yes. 37 is a good offer. One link. Missing one link, I paid $34,000. And the crystal was bad. Mm -hmm. So I don't think I will pay more than $35,000 for this watch naked. How it is. And then right here, Sky Dweller. Unworn complete set, 36.5. Read that on the bottom there. Unworn having been used. Okay. So this is a noble, number. right? What are you asking here? I want 45. 45. Yeah. What's the Four. best, best, best? 44. Because I, I already have enough for 43. Oh, you got an offer for the I will sell it. I will sell it for the 43, my brother. A lot of people are buying watches at the boutique thinking that they could sell it and make money and that day those days are over. I have the panda. How much? I have the panda. How much? And what did I get? They're brand new. They're 21, but they're brand new. But it's 21. How much for the panda? Daytona panda? How much? Yeah. I'll buy today, right now. Everything. Talk to me. Your price. To see you earlier. I have. I already put on his shop. Forget a his shop. He paid. I pay right now. He didn't pay me yet. I no, we pay right now. now. <laughs> we pay right now. Talk to me right now. I got money to spend. I'm buying. I'm buying. I'm buying, I'm buying at the I'll, right price. Yeah, after this, I'll, I'll go talk to him and how long I can get the money. Tell him. Tell him to stop playing. How much do you see need? how Judas is gonna buy. Twenty one. No, 20, I mean, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, no, no, the year, the year, oh, 21. 21. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm traumatized already, man. He's like, no, relax, probably, I got you. I'll make a package deal and I'll buy it everything. We're very close. The sky do to keep it, that's your, meant, your... It, it hurt me. It's, 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 it's a little hard. Yeah. That one is a little hard. No, it, no, but it, I'll, it I'll hurt take, me. I, I, I'll take everything else. The panda. The panda? 27.5. I'll buy. take it right now. I'll take this one for the 42. I'll take this one for the 35. Bring the stuff, man. I'm very fair. I'll buy it. I have the money right now. You work with me. Whatever we don't agree on the price, mm -hmm. Carlos, put it on consignment. I'm not going anywhere. No, we, we talk about this one first. And I'll, I'll we'll go take all of them. Mm -hmm. Come on. You want to get rid of them? You want to get rid of them? Get that behind your mind already. Collect your money and gone. This is something that I'm going to buy to put here. To rest if somebody comes in and buys it. Yes, because the, the thing is, I have to wait for him. For me, you don't gotta wait. Wire right now, yeah. check, whatever you want. You don't gotta wait nothing for me. Okay, let's do it. Or you can, let's do it. I'll go, I'll, I'll go get the phone. You're getting a wire, Mazak. <laughs> you got a wire, that's it. I just ordered this watch for a good friend and clients, I guess a uh, best friend. So his buddy's coming out to Miami and he wanted to have some fun here and pick up a watch real quick. We got this in from him, he's gonna be flying in. And look at this, 2024 chocolate date just 41. I was telling him, go with pre-owned like new. 
but there's nothing 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 like a true unworn true new watch look at that no fingerprints on it nothing the watch is wrapped clean i'm gonna go ahead and inspect it make sure it wasn't detailed and that's why it's so clean make sure it's true new before i call the client and then just let him know his watch is here and get this through are you a dealer no no it's my watch oh yeah it's I, don't, the, I don't wear it the way that you wrapped it oh because i polished it you polished it oh okay yeah, okay it's usually it's dealers who wrap the watches like that oh, yeah? that's why yeah, yeah. yeah. Rose Gold Sundust Dial Daytona. 2021. I bought that watch. Okay. I paid. Obviously, it was a different market. I paid, like, I think it was like 52, 53. Do you have more links? or? That's the way I bought it. That's the way it came. Just as is, right? Okay. Do you have a number in mind? Do you, do you have any offers? I have no idea. I mean, I paid 52 when I bought it. I don't wear it. It's stuck in my club. To be honest with you, I think you're going to be somewhere in the 30 range. Where in that 30 range? We got I gotta call Carlos to find out. I see them in dealer chats around 37,000 in similar condition, but with full links. So add two links to that. Whoever polished it ate a little bit of this edge off here. So that definitely needs some laser. And then if you notice here, it's a little bit rounded out, but not, not it's not the worst case. And the lugs here too. I talked to Carlos and and I gotta inspect it, make sure the movement and everything okay. is running good, cool, cool. but before inspection, I'll be at 34,000. So 35 Gs. There's uh -huh. the 35 Gs. I won't be able to do that. Right, so there's the 34 Gs, that's fine. I'll do 34. Yeah. Let me just inspect it, make sure the movement is good, yeah. and we'll do that, okay? My friend, do you know who Mr. T is? I know who Mr. T is. Of course, right? Yeah, I mean, you look just like him. I know, right? They, they just don't know, man. A buddy of mine got kind of duped with a fake watch and he sent me a text and he put real or fake and I put looks funny right off the bat and then I sent him a picture of what the real one looks supposed to look like and it's the been. thing is is that if it was an aftermarket gold case but it's not no. it's not, it's not even gold case. that watch has bad energy with it that model that specific model and yeah. when people go to sell or buy that watch people get excited and they don't look at the bigger picture and that's why mistakes happen because it's the same thing that that watch just has bad energy <laughs> i bet you what happened was is he thought he was getting a great deal on it and he got super excited right and he pulled the trigger let me tell you so that's something you tell me is don't get excited no matter how excited you are get excited when the money's on the side you know the minute he shined it to me i didn't even look at it i went like this i'm like no it's fake and he's like you're playing with me you're and playing with me no 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 it's fake <laughs> There you go, the clients represent one. Right here with CRM Charlie, we got Jessica on the line, we got Dan Danger back there. We're all hanging out on the block, checking out the block, making sure that everything's running smoothly down here. You know, we run the downtown. My name is Alex Pawlikowski. I'm here to pick up my first timepiece. Two tone J Just Rose Gold. Very excited. Oh man, look at that. Beautiful. She passed your inspection, huh? You don't got a small wrist, man. You don't got a small wrist at all. I think that has to be slid in a little bit. I got to adjust, adjust the tie. Very, very fast business. We got what I wanted very quickly. Appreciate you, Charlie. Thank of you. course, man. Of course. I got, I got you. Yo, yo, yo. What's up, homie? Check this out. You know that watch I told you about last week? The glide rolled up. He gave me the opportunity to come and show it to you. I begged him, but I wanted you to check it out. Mikey, but the, the guy who who picked it up, it just he must have been like entertained or something because this this watch is a little obvious. It's thick. It doesn't the bracelet. The watch doesn't weigh like a gold watch. Look at the, the spaces back here, just just alone with that. You see the, the thick space right there? Yeah. Bro, is that even the color is off, bro? Because I was gonna say you get somebody with like a celebrity or somebody to rock this, and you're not gonna think it's fake, but it's just thick. I don't even think it's gold. This watch is is a watch that's over a quarter million dollars we actually had one that we we sold for three hundred thousand, the peak of the market and um sometimes if a deal's too good to be true then eighty three thousand dollars on this first off the guy that should have raised the red flag for him it's crazy because you can lose a lot of money in a very quick second with something like this so this is why i stress you guys it's important to get your thing your, your watch is authenticated it's important to really trust the people that you're doing business with let's test this out with the gun all right so Look here, so the watch is not even testing that it's gold. AU, which is 
the element of gold is 1.63 or 0.15 percent so it's 0.39 of a carat so the swatch is, is gold plated is what it is thank god that they haven't got to the super clone level they have with rolex with ap's because that's going to be very very scary all right so the first thing we're going to notice is that when we spin when we uh, zoom into this quote unquote turb you're going to see one the rubies look pink and they don't have a hole it's just flat and then you see the finishing and this pin right there doesn't look like ap quality especially on a quarter million dollar watch nor does that screw or any of the finishing on this if you look right here this is the lip that i'm talking about this is unnecessarily thick these grain lines of the polishing are too thick and you can tell that this is not gold just because of the textures of the metal or if it is gold it's like really crappy casted you can see that finishing right here on the edge the printing is fading here look at this 27 jewels oh my god look at the grain lines on this here so all these scratches are from them not using plastic tweezers and using metal tweezers because any metal will scratch that so you have to use something very very soft here you can see very thick stroke line very very thick look at the edges all rough look at that eighty three thousand dollars that hurts my stomach like mikey i hope your friend is able to recuperate his eighty three thousand dollars i hope so too it hurts me for everybody watching online so things like this don't happen to you always get it checked always get it checked come come by here i'll help you out don't I'll feel get... confident yeah i mean if you have your experience you have your experience but always get a second opinion even me if i have my doubts even if it's 0.01 percent you're not talking about a hundred dollars you're not talking about twenty dollars you're talking about people's yearly salaries and not huh? only that the, and the market is every moment replicating these units better and better every single day we actually you know, have to update our knowledge on verifying these units because every day and every month it gets better and better. So yesterday, Carlos bought this watch. He threw a little rainbow bezel aftermarket that he had on in the safe just to rock it, but I didn't even give him time to rock it. Why? Because I just sold this watch before he sold it. So he thought he was going to do the purchase and then go ahead and take the commission. Mm -mm, not on my watch. So I went, I sold it before he did it. I'm going to go throw the factory bezel back on it, get it all nice and pretty, and go ahead and give it to that dealer. Looking to uh, trade in this Batman 2022. Trade up for this presidential here. First president? Alex and Yeah. Nice, man. Very nice. Can't go wrong with crazy. You have another daily? Oh, no. That. This almost came out here. I already dropped your watch on you. Oh, really? Yeah, look, you see yeah. your scoop? Yeah, I've been having to tighten it with my nail like the past week. Right. Let's inspect the watch. Let me get a little rack clean it up real quick. Oh, man. How'd you do that? Yeah, I have like this uh, metal little table and I was grabbing something under it and hit my hand like this oh um, you can't do that with the gold watch because no. <laughs> no, you'll take a good chunk out of it actually if you send this to Rolex Rolex doesn't do laser repair Rolex will just literally just try to make it smooth but then you're still gonna have that chunk coming out of it how I repair it is I laser weld it so the material is it dented in it's all rough yeah. you go ahead and you get the same type of stainless steel, same type of material for a Rolex. Since Rolex uses their own gold blends, you have to use a Rolex link uh, okay. that they turn into like a little wire and they start laser welding it. Really? And you start hitting the little laser welds. You fill in all this material. Now, where's the red flag? If you hit it that hard, hopefully nothing is damaged in this side. So that's why I got my machine there. I'm gonna okay. open it up, check it under the microscope. If everything is good, then we're good to go. So the threading isn't damaged. That's very important. Oh, look, you can see some of the oil. Nice. You see some of the oil? Yeah. yeah. So you can see the oil is kind of thick. It might be a little bit dirty, okay. the oil. So the watch might need a service, but yeah, what's going to tell us is this. So this, I definitely got to take it to the watchmaker. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Have you been wearing it? Yeah. You have? Okay, so let's just see. So you see, you have one line here, a little bit more straight and a little bit more jagged, right? Mm -hmm. You have plus six seconds of date, aptitude is 254, and a beat error of 0.9. Okay, so if it's okay with you, I have the watchmaker's right there. You can go with him or you can just have him take it however you like. And just have him give me a quote and see what he thinks on it. If it's just a service or if it needs parts. For me to purchase a watch from a 
private client, I gotta do a document called the Leads Align, which I have to wait 30 days to sell uh, pre-owned goods or to make sure they're not stolen, X, Y, Z. So you have a receipt and everything. Yeah. So it's not you, just you have to do by the state of Florida, right? right? So it doesn't make sense for me to purchase at the same price I can get it on a phone call, right. not having to wait. If the watch was in perfect condition, I would be at 13.5, which is 10% less than it cost me on a dealer check. So, so watch it needs a little bit of work, a service like I told you cost me anywhere from seven fifty to eight. I'm sorry, from six fifty to, to eight fifty. I could do the thirteen five minus seven hundred bucks, which is what I would pay for the watch. In perfect. I was trying to be like at fourteen. If the watch didn't have this massive dent on it, I would definitely. And if I didn't have that B air, I would definitely be at thirteen a thirteen. I'm not that far from fourteen, but that's what it is. And how much are you selling this for? So um, we're asking on this piece thirty six thousand. I don't know if you gave you a better price or not. I gave him thirty five. Okay. You're at 22. Two. So, but how much are you offering? 12 eight. The band? 12, eight. 12 eight, which is 35 minus 700. 13 and then 34 5. Yeah. 700 bucks. It's the 700 bucks I'm paying. It's the same thing. The $700 I took off, you want me to put it back on and I can't do it. It's like paying you 14 and 35. Okay. It's the same way, however, you are the numbers. I won't be able to add $700 to the deal because I need to invest at least seven to 800 bucks on this. Then I'll take your offer and then we do 34 5. You have a lot of business for me in the future and all my other friends too. Got you. Are you gonna pay in crypto? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So you just have to pay the one person on the crypto? That's fine. I'll do a 34 5. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, brother. No problem. Thank you. What was the best deal we could get on the we can get on the toast there on the day toast? The day toast? With the blue dial. Uh, the blue dial with the jubilee. Yeah. Can you can I see it? Of course. I can I can do fourteen instead of fourteen, 14? five. Yeah. Alright, nice. Okay, so what about if, if I go crazy because I'm, I'm I'm deciding, okay, so I'm thinking. If I go between this one and the other one, per se, you can I get the deal of 50k here, right? You say you could do a thousand dollars. The 2023? Yeah. Well, I had to see what the price that I bought it for. So you're willing to get the 2021 and okay. pay more, just because the car says a different day? Oh, because of the year. Why not? That's. I mean, really? you know, if we come, you know, if oh. I want to sell it later, you know, just no, looking at the two thousand dollars difference. You, so. but that's why you're paying a different price on that one. I like this one a lot. Damn, that's a tough decision, though. What's the best you can do in this? 14. 14? Don't no. listen to that? No, 14. Jeez. No. You're trying to trick the, the, I mean, no, the no, worst no, one no. to trick here. You I can know, trick that's why, yeah. <laughs> that's why I get, That's why I haven't get a good deal, you know? <laughs> I'm giving you a good deal. Okay, okay. So I'm going to get this one here. Yeah. How you doing, Will? Doing good, man. Doing good. Just moving some crawfish. You ready for some ball crawfish? Yeah, man, I've never had it. I'm excited for it. It's a whole lot different experience when you have a true Cajun cooking some true Cajun crawfish for you the right way. You guys have some crabs too, I see behind you? Yes, sir, we do. We do deal with live blue point crabs, uh, fresh Louisiana Gulf shrimp, white shrimp, brown shrimp, pretty much just about any kind of seafood I can get my hands on here in Louisiana. What are you thinking about doing? What do we, what do we got in mind? So, man, I'd, I'd like to try to get to you guys maybe Memorial Weekend or even sometime after Memorial Weekend. So I'm hoping that I can uh, get to you and cook you some ball crawfish, man, for the family Oof. and for all the viewers, man. That would be you know, awesome. You, show, show a little bit of uh, the New Orleans culture to, uh, to the world. I don't even know if that's ever been done. Some, some actual true live Cajun crawfish boiled out on an island just off of Miami. Well, well, I'm very looking forward to this. I haven't even told the fam because they're going to go crazy. So me and Dan are keeping it on the low. Yeah, they don't know yet. But we're going to have some fun and uh, I look forward to doing this. All right. Sounds good, man. Thanks, awesome, Dan. Man. Thanks, Charlie. Man, you guys have a good day. And, Thank you, man. You too. Thank you so much for your time. Take it easy. Yes, sir. Okay, so client brought him this watch to get authenticated. Um, they're selling him this watch and yeah. this is something that I recommend to people to do. The client's in a hurry, so I'm going to go ahead and go to the most determining factor. So we're gonna go ahead and pop this case back out and make sure the movement is authentic. <laughs> so the conclusion is the watch isn't authentic. The client was in a bit of a hurry, so I went straight to the movement instead of inspecting the outside first. And in the movement, it turns out that the rubies just look all poor quality, poor craftsmanship. The inside, the screws, it doesn't look like AP quality. And when you're paying thousands of dollars for a watch, you're gonna see that craftsmanship in there. But this AP, unfortunately, isn't authentic. So we're having Chella, I'm teaching her how to write an invoice for the AP uh, open work that we just sold. She has to learn. She already knows how to answer the phone, how to take clients' information down. I'm teaching my little sister, my little princess here, uh, how to make invoices now. So she can have every aspect. She knows how to make content. She knows how to, like I said, phone calls. She knows how to sell. Yep. 
boss baby. But like when I spin it around it, it feels like it's like, I don't know. Like none of my other ones do that. They're smooth. There's something wrong with this watch. Really? Guaranteed. It, it doesn't go, it goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It's jumping, something is jumping. Here. Yeah. See the difference? Yeah, yeah, 100%. You want to find out what it is? I mean, I'll take it to the watch. You want to go to the watch maker with me real quick? Sure. Eh? Show me the watch here. We'll go. Okay. Come on, check it out. Jose, I want you to wind this watch and tell me what you think. I hear like a jump, like. My spring is no oil. No oil. So I need to change the oil and I'm full set with this watch. So he said it's like a spring that is going around on a circle like this, like kind of like a bucket, and, and it has these teeth right there, right? That one. But when it has oil, it goes smoothly. Mm -hmm. But when it's not, it gets stuck, and then you see that jump. Do a service, man. If you can, if you're not selling it, just try to do a service. What is that? We came out on a video showing how um, we need to get things for the ladies from Leo Pine. Oh! So he said, I'll send something over there. So listen. There we go, That's more nice. lady stuff. More lady stuff. Mm -hmm. These ones you have. And thank you, Ambassador Hoodie. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you guys? Hello. Doing good. Oh, the store looks good, man. The watch is still working? Yes, of course. Oh. <laughs> I'm matching my watch today. Are you still happy? Of course. Uh, awesome. Let me sign. That's fine. I read the day I buy it. Wait, what is that? He doesn't know what that it's, is. It's, it's two okay. circles, right? Dan or something, no? This is Dan, oh my god. <laughs> I'm thankful, very thankful for everyone at CRM, so I just wanted to bring over the jersey they brought me and have everyone sign it and just have it as memorabilia for this trip. Yeah.